Hey there, everybody. Pete Pardo here from CE Tranquility. Welcome to another edition of What's Hot with CE Tranquility. Today we got a single release that came out oh, a couple weeks back. And I was going to do this amongst a bunch of other new things, but I figured, you know what? This one's notable enough, cool enough, interesting enough, intriguing enough to kind of do a quick little episode all on its own, right? So I'm talking about the latest ECM release from the trio of David Torn. Tim Burney and Chess Smith called Son of Goldfinger. All right, so obviously if you are a jazz fan or if you're into like fusion and avant-garde music, electronic music, that sort of thing, you're going to want to hear this, okay? So let's pull this out here, pull the booklet out here and give you a little back history. I'm, I'm a David Torn fan. I've always loved the guy. He's such a great guitar player, but he's not by any means a conventional player, right? He does all the loops and weird noises, and, you know, the guy can shred if he wants to, but he generally doesn't do that sort of thing. So we've got, uh, let's get to pictures here. So there's Mr. Uh, Mr. Torn on electric guitar, live looping and electronics. All right. And then we've got uh, Tim Burney on alto sax and Chaz, Chaz Smith on drums, electronics, and Tanbu, whatever the hell that is. All right, there they are right there. So this was recorded, let's get some information here, recorded September 2015 and August 2018. So they've been kind of working on this for a while at the Bunker in Brooklyn Recording Studios. All right. Uh, it's a very interesting album. It kind of like ebbs and flows and bobs and weaves. It's very like experimental King Crimson-ish at times. Okay, uh, trust me on that. Uh, Torn every now and then like does these little bursts of like guitar that almost sound like Fripp uh, and all the electronics, the, the kind of moody, ominous electronics going around with all the loops and things like that. But the cool thing is the uh, the scream and sax, right? Uh, from uh, from Bernie. Really, really good stuff. If you've ever heard any of Tim's other stuff on ECM, I highly recommend it. Really good. Scream and squonk and sax. So this is like, you know, like I said, bits of, it's total avant-garde. It's electronic. It's ambient. It's free jazz. It, it's like all these things wrapped up into one. So you got a tune called uh, I Metal, okay, which is the trio. And that's like, uh, what, 24 minutes long and then you got track number two which is called spartan before it hit another 22 minute track uh written by torn which has uh some additional musicians on it so it's got uh, craig taborn on electric piano and then you've got the scorchio quartet which is uh let's see three violin players a cellist another guitar player mike but Bajetta, and actually two guitar players, Mike Bajetta and Ryan Ferriera. And then on uh, violin, we got Amy Kimball, Rachel Golub, uh, Martha Mook, and uh, Lee Koloff. All right, so that's kind of like this little weird little mini orchestra, so to speak. So to speak. And then the last track, another epic track, is Soften the Blow, uh, again written and performed by the trio, which is... Uh, about near 23 minutes long. So it's just one of those cool albums that you kind of, it, it's pretty haunting listening at times. You, you just kind of pop it on and it's just like, you know, you get the loops that are kind of bubbling and boiling and blipping and all that kind of stuff. And then, you know, every now and then Torn will come in with his like, you know, ragged, jagged, screaming guitar licks. And then you got, you know, Bernie who just comes in with the, like I said, his just amazing sax but it's noisy it's chaotic it's dissonant um it's just a very very cool album that uh I, I like more and more the more i listen to it again it's not an album that don't expect like kind of cool syrupy melodies this is not a pleasant melodic sweeping jazz album okay this is more like like i said kind of ominous and dangerous sounding and uh, foreboding all right far reaching that sort of thing so son of goldfinger tim tim bernie ches smith david torn i like this a lot in fact i'm really upset because these guys played in a tiny little kind of club or studio right here in my town recently but i was i was away and i was like ah i would have loved to have seen that but um you know what are you going to do can't do everything, right? Can't always be in the right place at the right time. So, but uh, yeah, if you're a David Torn fan, you're going to love this. But uh, it, it's just as notable for the other two players. And uh, a really cool 
album that kind of, you know, makes your mind kind of think and work a little bit harder than it normally does, right? Definitely not something you just put on in the background for that kind of like little background noise while you're cooking dinner or vacuuming the rug or whatever. This is stuff that you kind of, you listen to and you're like, ooh, you know, check that out. It takes you on a journey, so to speak. So very interesting sounds, um, dramatic stuff, creepy stuff at times. It's it, definitely mood music, right? Big time. So uh, so check it out. There's a full review of this on the website at www.catranquility.org. Of course, we're on Facebook, we're on Twitter, of course, we're on the mighty YouTube here. Often, often, often. Got all sorts of cool things coming up. What else we got? We got... Uh, Going to review this. I'll just give you a little preview of what's to come uh, this week and next week. Uh, the new Snarky Puppy. Immigrants. Going to review that. The brand new Motorcycle, The Crucible. Going to review that. What else we got here? Jeez, all sorts of stuff. You know what? That's all you're going to get for now. <laughs> you got to stay tuned for those, right? So get the appetite going for it. So anyway, uh, come back soon. Tell your friends. Subscribe. Come back often. Go check out the playlist, guys. Seriously. All right? I get so many people who put in questions like every day on various videos. Pete, have you ever done this? Pete, have you ever done this? Go, a lot of stuff in the play. That's why I set up the playlist so you guys can find old content easier. So whether if you're looking for top 10 songs, go to that playlist. If you're looking for best to worst albums, go to that playlist. If you like the What's Hot stuff or to hear about all the new releases, go to the uh, you know the new product What's Hot playlist. All right. If you like the interviews, go to the interviews playlist. If you you know whatever it is, whatever type of show we've got, there's a playlist for it. You can go and look through and find the content you're looking for. All right. So check them out, please do, and we'll see you next time. Bye bye.